right guys, quick little review of the Watt Cycle lithium ion phosphate battery. This is a 12 amp hour on the smaller side. And we're gonna do a little test. We're gonna put it through its paces, check the capacity, and let you guys know exactly what you're working with on this. So, cute little battery. Great for powering something small. Um, a little scooter or um, small electronics. Uh, it's great. You can just put uh, anything that uses 12 volt technology onto these. The lithium ion phosphate is, is my personal favorite, depending on what you're trying to do. Uh, lithium ion phosphate is a little heavier, uh, but it's more robust. So I'd rather trade some weight for. Uh, a battery technology that um, is going to last me a long time. So let's see here. Test the voltage that it comes with. Try to do this one handed. And we got 13.25 volts, which is pretty good. That's uh, on the higher side of the uh, charge. Sometimes these things don't come very charged. So what we'll do is we'll grab the charger and uh, we'll give her a good charge before we test the capacity. We got it hooked up to the charger. This is a lithium ion phosphate. Uh, it's a 10 amp charger. I haven't really seen it do 10 amps, but it gets pretty close. Uh, and these are very affordable. And you can also charge any of the other types of battery technologies out there. All in one deal. Nice big alligator clips. And as soon as we get her charged up, we'll uh, use this little guy to discharge and test the capacity of the battery. Slippery. Slippery. There we go. All right, the way this works is it'll tell you the voltage. So it's 13.5 volts. And all we have to do is adjust these knobs to set either a coarse amperage or a fine amperage <clears throat> and we can tell exactly how many amps it draws right quick check-in looks like we're still chugging along at 2.43 amps we have drained about 24 watt hours all right the test is complete we almost hit 12 amp hours in this battery. We're going to go ahead and charge it back up and do one more test. All right, final results are in. We have exactly 12 amp hours of capacity out of this watt cycle 12 amp hour battery. So she performed to spec, which is great. We are going to turn this into actually a really large battery bank. I'll put the capacity up on the screen for you. But what we're going to do is we're going to add a USB adapter to this that will convert 12 volts into 5 volts for USB. So this is a cool little adapter uh, next to the battery and uh, it gives us a few USB ports. So let's hook that up and see how it works. USB adapter on here giving us a voltage reading which is pretty cool it could tell you the current uh, voltage of your battery so you know where it's charged up to since we depleted it all the way we're charging it back up and uh, we will have a very large battery bank to charge all our USB devices this little adapter is pretty cool it turns on and off as you need it 
Cool. Hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe. Stay tuned for more. I'm just starting out the channel, so uh, we got a whole bunch more projects coming down the line. Even maybe some of these mini bikes. Electric. Yeah. See you guys soon.